In Stacking Up today, I'm joined by Tad Bubba Horowitz here with I'm here. some stocks to talk about on this yeah. Fed Day. So happy Fed Day to you. Happy Fed Day to you. What's your Fed trade? Uh, well, I mean, my Fed trade, I got two Fed trades. One that really is directly related to the Fed, and that would be the TLT. You know, we have seen a destruction in the TLT and in the bonds. I gave it out here once before, and it has not performed well. But I think now you, you have a, a, a thing to look at. Market expectations have built in the rate increase. The TLT has gotten more pounded with the bonds than, than the rate. So we're, I think there's either going to be a, a bigger raise or we're going to get a tremendous rally off of the announcement. So I'm going to, I'm going to buy the TLT. I'm going to play it through the options. I want to take a very low risk attempt here and I'm going to use the options that expire on Friday. And basically I'm just going to buy the at the money calls at about noon and, and look to play the action off of that because I think it's got a great chance to play and I think this could move up two, three dollars off of the announcement. SLW, a silver play. Silver Wheaton is another play for you. Yeah, you know what? Again, the Fed will have direct influence on what happens in the metal space. Silver Wheaton has been a stock beaten down, again, down around the $19 range. Has earnings next week. I want to go ahead and set up a longer term position here. Now, either you can buy the stock if, if you don't trade options. Or if you trade options, I would be looking to use some sort of like a what I would call a weighted iron condor and I would weight it to the to the bull side or to be long calls and I what, I, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to sell some put spreads this week and next week and then I'm going to buy out in April a little bit farther out I'm going to I'm going to buy a, a ratio which will if you put those all together it creates a basic iron condor that's weighted to the positive side so I think it's going to go higher I want to try to collect some premium while I'm waiting, but also be long if it does break out to the upside. Now you say Twitter is also on your list. Yeah, I think Twitter's finally found a level at around 15, it's a little bit over 15. But A, I think it's in play. I think it's got a shot to get bought out. But they, you know, with, the, with Snap coming out, there may be something here and it may actually help them learn how to monetize their business. And I think it's, a, I think it's at a fair level at a fair price that you can make a few bucks on it. Well, I hope you do. Thank you for coming on the show. My pleasure, thank you.